final position of the setout points can be checked against the design in a number of ways. We will look at three ways here. Firstly, we're going to read in a file which has some as constructed points. We select File I.O., Data Input 12DA, 4DA. We select the File to Read folder icon and browse up a level and double click on Road ASCON Survey and click Read. If we then finish this panel, if we go back near the start of the road and turn off our Smith Street sections and string models, you'll see we have a number of readings here. We have a road edge of pavement string. We have some points which are topo surface level, which are readings taken on the road pavement. There are also some points here where we have a design electricity point and an ASCON electricity point where we've actually taken the reading to check that it's in the right position. So we're going to look at three different types of reports. The first one is to check survey points versus design points and here we will be looking at the light poles. We select report, QA report, check survey point versus design points two. We pick the model of the electricity light. The design data was the design light. And we're going to give it a report file. And we'll just call it lights as con. The search radius will be 0.5 of a meter. And the tolerance method will be by change and offset. Here we can pick the alignment string and the change in offset will be referenced to this string. The change tolerance will be 0 0.05 and the offset tolerance will be 0 0.05 as well and the elevation tolerance will be 0 0.03 of a meter. OK, we click Run and then we look at the report file by clicking on the folder icon next to Report File and clicking Open. We now see a list of the readings. We have the point number of the surveyed point, the corresponding design point, and you'll see the differences in chainage, offset and elevation are listed here. Also a radial distance is shown here. You'll also get a summary of the readings down the bottom here. The next report we'll look at will be checking the difference between an as constructed string and the design string. Here we're going to just turn on our Smith Street strings model and just zoom in near the start. We're going to use the option report, QA report, check as built string versus design string. Here we pick the as built string pick button and we pick until we get our model road edge of pavement the design string will obviously be the design string it's sitting next to, which is Smith Street Strings, and the name is EOBR. And the control string is our alignment string. So again, we just pick until we pick the alignment string. We're going to report the horizontal differences, the vertical differences, and we're going to report both at the as-built string vertice and a regular chainage. The interval will leave at every 5 metres, the chainage will start at zero, but we're only going to go as far as 40. The report file will just be called Pavement Edge ASCON. Press Enter and click Report. Again, we click on the folder icon and open up the report file. And you get the reporting of the strings, giving you the horizontal distance and vertical distance. This is at the actual vertices and then down lower you'll get them at the even changes. The third type of reporting will be to check the points that we took on the pavement to the actual design triangulation. So to do this option we select reports, QA reports, checkpoints versus tin. Here we pick the model of the readings which is topo surface level we pick the tin to check against, which is Smith Street. 
and we're going to give the tolerances of 10 millimeters above, 10 millimeters below, the pavement depth is zero, and the report file will be pavement ASCON. We then tick to report the change in offset to the center line, and then we pick on the alignment string icon again and accept. We click report, open the report file, and you can see our results here and you'll see the vertical differences and anything that is outside of our tolerance is flagged in the outside of tolerance column. Also any if the points have been given any names then they're displayed over on the right as well.